girls and boys, welcome to Storytime Fun. I dedicate this next book to my sweet smiling granddaughter, Victorious Violet. Today's story is called It's Fancy to be Violet. And even though this is dedicated to my precious granddaughter, Violet, there's something in here for all of us kids. I hope you enjoy. Written by Jennifer Dewing. Violet, where will you go? What will you see? Imagine the fancy new things you can be. Violet, you jet off to Paris and wear a beret. Ooh la la, it's such a marvelous day. You are mod, you are vogue, swanky and chic. You stroll with your poodle tray, magnifique. Now off to London in a gown with a muff. Or a tea party dress with your hair all a fluff. Ciao from Milan. You sing opera on stage in your elegant gown. You're all the rage. To Germany in green, to Africa in red, to China in silk with a straw hat on your head. It's Carnival, Violet. You're off to Brazil. The music and movement give you a thrill. A frock with some fringe, a hoop skirt and wide hat. Or a fancy New York girl out walking her cat. Violet, at the Palace of Versailles, your wig is powdered in white. It has oodles of curls stacked up for height. A Russian fur hat, a sari in gold, an Egyptian crown amongst treasures untold. It's fun to dress up and visit countries afar, but it's what is inside of you that defines who you are. So wherever you go and whatever you do, the fanciest thing, Violet, is just to be you. And I think that's a good message for all of us kids. That's it for today. See you next time.